I've been trying to get my hands on this truck for a year. Look at this. <laughs> this is half a million dollars. It has four steps. One, two, three, four. And you need every single one. It's also got six doors. And when you pull this one out, little step comes down too. Look at the size of this thing. This right here is actually also a gas tank that you can fill up through here. <laughs> and look at the size of this exhaust pipe. This is actually functional. It's not just for decoration. 65 inch tires. They don't even fit on the frame. And now you might be wondering, how would anyone put anything in here? The answer is in here. Got a little caution because when you press bed down, this entire piece detaches and comes down. And that's where these little wheels come in. <laughs> this thing is ridiculous. You, you heard that train horn, right? Look underneath. That's where the horns are, right there. As well as in the front. Get that surround sound. This is eight people. But oh, watch this. Come on in. This becomes a bed. This is like, you know, this is like a house. Seriously, when you come on inside, come inside. Look at how much space you have. You have these two 17 inch monitors. But what I just think is bizarre is how much room. It's like a living room, right? Let's go to the front. This is so high up. Look at this seat. It's like they're practically touching the steering wheel, but when you sit down, it sinks right in. You got this yellow button, which I didn't know what it was for, but basically when you turn the car on, this is how you take it out of parking because you'll realize that there's no pee here. You have to put it in neutral and then to drive. This right here is a fridge. Look at that. You can like store your frozen meats in here. It's huge. This is a 10 liter V8 with 370 horsepower. And you need a trucking license to drive this thing because it weighs over seven tons. This thing is huge. When you sit on it, you feel like you're so high up, you know? King of the castle, king of the castle. <laughs> Anyways, let me know what you guys think. I've been waiting on this car for a year and I'm buzzing that I can finally get it. Thanks to Q Motors for bringing this out. We'll see you guys next time.